This is the Pocket Monster Manual. I'm Wooly Shambler here with Ironclad Lou. Hi. MD. Hello. Shadow Missing now. Hi. And Specs. Hello. We are talking Sand Slash. Sand Pan. The Sonic of the Pokemon world. <laughs> he is. Especially a little. Would Sand Pan in Japanese not mean sand bread? Yes. No, it's from Sand and Pangolin. It's because oh. they breed in the sand. Huh? Um, oh, I see. Bread. It's funny. It was a funny joke. Thank you for laughing. They they bred in the sand. Uh... Oh, that Chinese stupid. name. King of going through mountains. <laughs> <laughs> so awesome. Also, his uh, his shiny sprite looks like Knuckles, the fighting freak. Bust resist urge to rap. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm trying to beat it. <laughs> I almost tried it just going in on Pumpkin Hill, but you ready? I ain't Wait. gonna let it get to me. I'm just gonna creep down a pumpkin hill. I gotta find my lost piece. Don't want to hear this. Please edit all of this out. <laughs> um, no, I'll, I'll put the song in. <laughs> It is skilled at lashing enemies with its claws. If broken, they start to grow back in a day. This makes me wonder if Knuckles was based more on what Sand Slash was based on or what, because like... Is there anything uh, interesting to say about him, aside from the fact that he rolls into a ball and bikes stuff? I mean, he's cool looking, just in general. I mean, yeah, I like he is him. very cool looking. What do they say about the Lowland boy? Steel spikes are teeth in ice, stabs from these spikes cause deep wounds and severe frostbite. Ah. Oh, shit. Ooh. That's pretty sick. That Injecting pretty cool. ice. I like that, that he uses his fingernails to climb icebergs. That's cool, also. One of my friends thought Sand Slash when we were a kid was grass type because he thought the things on his back were like dead leaves. Ah. I kind of see that, yeah. That's a concept that I don't hate. Like a ghillie suit. Yeah. <laughs> Sand Slash, the official sniper of the Pokemon world. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, Sand Slash has never really been like. I don't think any trainer has ever like had a signature Sand Slash. You know what I mean? Like, none of the gym leaders were like, "Yeah, here comes my trump card." And I don't think he's really ever been in the show much. So not really. No. I don't know. I just like he's there. Ah, he's uh, all yeah. right. I I don't think he's a bad boy. There's there's a bad boy. He's a bad man. <laughs> um, there's just not much to say about him, really. Like, I I like Sand Slash. I think he's a cool Pokemon. I like Sandshrew yeah. and Sand Slash, but they're they're not that interesting. I th I like them from a design perspective, like how they look more than anything else about them. I agree, and like yeah. every Pokemon doesn't need to be the most interesting thing either. It's good to have like these. Like, they're just yeah. there, and that's fine. There's animals you don't like in real life. And... Yeah. You can't get to 800 Pokemon without having a few kind of middle-of-the-road ones. At least he's not Pidgey. <laughs>